Hello guys, good morning and welcome back. Alright, so in today's video, I want us to learn one important thing on fabric and its use or usage. Now, I have met several people you know, asking me fabric name, the texture, the price, um, the, the feeling, the weight of the fabric, the durability and every other attributes of certain fabrics. Now, I mentioned um, something to them. I told them that they need to get um, a fabric swatch, right, or swatch. Um, some people tend not to understand. So I'm here to show you guys what swatch is or sample is because um, the compilation of different fabrics in certain dimensions is called a swatch. S W A T C H. Yeah. S W A T C H is called a swatch. So this swatch could be used to go to your different customers for them to make their selections. Unlike you know gathering pieces in the office or packing pieces in the place, you could as well prepare this swatch and make it available for them. Or better still, you can as well uh, make it um, get it from um, dealers, those that sell fabrics or those that sell um, sewing um, items, right? So now I have two types of swatch with me. So this is called a swatch, right? So this is the first one. So this is an Irish swatch, meaning that all the fabrics in here are Irish materials. All the fabrics in here are what Irish materials. So now, if you can get this, it will be very, it will be very, very good for you and accessible for you to use whenever you want to go to a client to choose fabric color, texture, and prices. You could get this in three or four different grades of fabric. The same fabric grade must contain in one swatch. Don't mix different grades in one, no. Rather, maintain one particular grade in different colors so that they will know they want to choose. You can get this for cashmere, one. Irish, one. Um, John Koso, one. You know, linen, you know, virgin wool, um, damask, um, what's, it, what's the one again? Um, um, Java, cashmere 220, cashmere 180, and even cashmere 300. Now, these things might cost a bit, but if you happen to get a good dealer that has this in quantity, he will be willing to give you for free so that you can make use it to get customers for him, right? So, I have it in two. This is for the, um, the regular stock fabric, right? Look at how beautiful it is. So, imagine you went to a client with this book and he wants to have a few of different fabrics and texture you could as well hand him over this he will go he will go through it and feel the texture and know what the material feels like and then if he's okay with the texture can now go ahead and choose the color in here or if the color is not in here you can now you can now move the color and then get it for him so this is very essential tool for all fashion designers so likewise, this as well. This is for the Irish and this is for the um, stock fabric. So I got it from my supplier, you know, he do have it. So whenever I go there, I check for the one that is um, current and I pick up one, you know, so that I have different look at the colors that are in there, very lovely colors. So as you're also learning, um, uh, getting to get this, also learn the colors, the names of the colors. Because as every fashion designer should be able to identify colors and know the shades of it, just like this two fabric now. These two here could be called gold, but one is um, custard gold and one is um, dark gold, right? So you tend to um, golden yellow. Sorry, one is golden yellow and one is um, dark gold. So you tend to. Um, Ask them, yeah, golden yellow is still that good and it's still custard gold. So you tend to know the fabric um, 
color shades because you have different shades of black taco black and a plain black and they have also midnight black so you also have blue right blue it could be a royal blue or navy blue you can also have sky blue you have purple you have peach you have um coffee brown you have um uh, this is um light ash this is dark ash uh, i think this is also like ash i think this is a, a, another shade of ash so you know you have ox blood you have um, wine red you have orange you have um, army green you have um, sea green you have um, this should be um, uh, this is also a, sh a shade of green you know so they have different um, fabric colors here so this will also help you to learn more of colors now aside the fact that it will help you to make your work to be handy because you don't need to start going along with pieces all over whenever you want to or start to describe to customers when you can easily get this and hand them over so the importance of this could not be overemphasized so i have known that this exists but i have not thought it wise to use it but the moment i started using it i saved myself the stress of customers being so choicy or picky so once I give them this, I allow them to make their choice by themselves. And, you know, I will now use pen, pen, and mark the one they chose. Mark it in a way that it won't, you know, obstruct the general um, um, view of the fabric. So mark it, maybe a dot or two dots to serve for you. Or better still, just note the one you picked by snapping. If you don't want to dent the material. So this is called sample or swatch. So when people actually come to your place and ask you, do you have sample of fabric? What they meant is this, <laughs> and not the one you go to your shelf to bring out. Those ones are still sample, but it is not professional to bring those stuff for them to spill. It is either you give them the real fabric in the box or you give them this fabric in this pattern. So this is called actually a sample or swag look at how beautiful it is right so make do well to get this and uh, try to go with them whenever whenever you're going to once you're going for negotiations you know measurement taking you know even fabric sourcing you can go with this so that you can actually get what you're looking for it's actually handy you can put it in your you know cross crossing back or however so I believe you might have or must have learned something from this so do well to drop your comments ask your questions you know like the video drop a heart emoji if you find the video interesting and finally subscribe to my channel please help me and grow this channel subscribe to the channel let us grow to 100k follower and subscribers on youtube right and also Follow me on my page as redefined on Facebook for us to reach to 100k as well. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in my next episode of Fabric Detailing and Information. Bye bye for now.